What's up, all stars? This is Joking John 74 here, bringing you episode two of our Let's Play NCA 13: Road to Glory. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the first episode because in this episode it's gonna be a lot more fun because we're gonna be running all over the opponent's ass, guys. Yes, I said it. We're gonna be running all over the freaking ass, and we're gonna be playing our first high school games, guys. So yeah, stay tuned for that. But first, we're gonna show you the schedule that we have. So here are the teams, as you can see here: Harlingen South Seminoles, McAllen Memorial, Lopez Lobo, Seminito Greyhounds, Porter Cowboys, Browns Hannah Eagles, Rivera Raiders, Los Frenzos Falcons, and West Coast Panthers. Now, for sure, you're wondering to yourselves: Are these real teams yes they are real teams i have downloaded their real uniforms i did not create all the uniforms those uniforms were already created by other people as you can you can search your own hometown as you can see people already created your high school so you guys want to download that guys you guys want to download my team which is bronzo uh pace high school you can download it you know search it up and uh you can see the real names on the characters i did put every single name i did create the bronzo pace that's the only team i created and um you're gonna be able to see my real name there so yeah guys you know if you guys want to search it up please search it up in team builder all right guys so now let's go back to the schedule because i would like to explain a little bit more about it the schedule is set up to my senior year schedule guys that, that i had in my real life so uh there's gonna be a lot of memories being brought back guys it's gonna be awesome i would like to tell you a lot of stories about it you know what happened in this kind of situations and uh this opponent and stuff like that i would love to tell you stories guys and hopefully you guys like that and if you have your own story guys you know please leave a leave a comment in the comment section explaining your story i'm gonna leave a like on your comment once once i'm done reading it because you know i'm showing you respect guys and hopefully you guys like that so yep that's all i have for the schedule guys so now let's start the game god damn it's taking a while to load so a little bit more information about this Hardigen South Seminoles you know the guys look like the Miami U instead of having the U on their helmet they had an S so yeah we look kind of awkward and uh, you know I did not download the uniforms so yeah we're gonna be missing out on that guys and also on the next team I did not download the next team's uniform so it's just two, two teams that I did not download it for and god damn it just bring me the chills just watching this uniform man look at that so beautiful look at that just looking just watching the helmet and the freaking jerseys just like it's a beautiful feeling man i suggest to download your own uniforms that you had in high school and you're gonna have the greatest experience in nca 13 because god damn man just brings me a lot of memories just watching that man just like i just i love to be playing this game man i love it and you'll love nca 13 so much just by watching your old uniforms in this game because god damn man just god damn it just give you that that feeling of happiness somehow <laughs> so yeah guys um so now let's start start a little bit of story time guys because you know i want to explain to you what happened to me in real life against hardage and south and uh, the thing that happened to me in real life is that i lost my starting job to a sophomore now don't start laughing guys <laughs> you know i'll give you the reason why i lost my job you know the guy was 221 pounds and he was six foot one so yeah you know who would choose him or me man because <laughs> uh you know i was 249 pounds and 511 i mean of course height and weight would beat that and the guy was pretty skillful also you know he was taught pretty well by his older brother Rigo Morales who was a uh, first district all center back in 1989 in the year 2000 team and uh, who also played in that team a builder shocker to 60 he got first district all defensive end that year man that team Brownsville Pace team was uh, eight and two and that was like the best team of all time of Brownsville and uh, you know they went to the playoffs and lost by a point like 21 to 20 and uh, you know it was a pretty sad ending it was like the St. Louis Rams against Tennessee Titans ending and you understand that and you might want to search that up you know St. Louis Rams against Tennessee Titans that that ending ended up like my brother's ending at um, his final senior year game and um, you know I think it was a pretty amazing ending but they, I know they could have scored man but you know he was tackled five yards before the goal line that's pretty sad <laughs> so yeah you know I lost my job I ended up being as a uh, in special teams I ended up being in field goal and in punts so you know I still got some action guys I had fun around the field you know people um, other players were like you know you can do better than that I know you can end up being started at the end of the season or something like that but you know enjoy your moment here because you know it's your final year here in senior year Year and uh, playing football and stuff like that, you might not get this opportunity again. And I was like, okay, you know, I'll just go all out in special teams so coaches can notice me, and I'll go like all out and punt so I can get that tackle and get the fumble, get a fumble return, go all the way to the touchdowns. Because that was my goal in punt, you know, I was like, I wanted to score and stuff. So yeah, guys, I ended up being in special teams in the first game, and I didn't start until the third game. So yeah, that would be an interesting story to tell, guys. So you know, that would be like a little episode. So hopefully, you guys like this little story time, guys. If you want me to shorten it up a little bit more, you know, I will, guys. We commentate no make sure to commentate and uh, i'll read them guys don't worry i'll read them and i'll make sure i make some changes to this so yeah guys if you guys enjoy the story time you know leave a like and uh you know you guys any you guys got any questions you know any more questions of what like how i felt or what happened in the situation you know please comment in the comment section 
Give me the ball, coach. I can get that first down. Come on, it's all about me. It's all about Jordan Nandez right here, man. Oh, give me the ball, baby. Get it that first down, baby. Oh, shit, open field, open field. Go, oh, Matrix. Uh, yes, touchdown. Next time, move your ass, receiver. God damn it. Give me the ball, coach. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, my God. Get your ass owned, man. Cut the grass taste. Down to the left. Oh, my God. Fullback. Come on, man. How the hell can you miss 20 foot behemoth? What? He threw it to somebody else? How dare him? And the middle quarterback. Oh shit, watch out with that linebacker. Oh fuck. You know, I could've gotten a concussion, you fucking asshole. Quarterback, you see what happens when you don't throw it to me? There you go, coach. You better give me that ball, man. I'll block. Block, goddammit, it, Olin. Yes, Matrix mode. Oh shit. Yeah, first down. First down, baby. First down. God damn it, tight end. Why don't you freaking block? Now I have to go Matrix mode. God damn it. God damn it. You see? I could've freaking scored. If you would've blocked that guy, I would've scored, man. Yeah, QB. Oh my god. You know, coach, I was gonna score, but uh, you know, the quarterback threw it behind me so i don't know what was the point of that play you ain't stopping this train you ain't stopping this train come on boy come on boy ah oh, god damn it one yard away you know what give me the ball game coach can you just give me the ball you know let's go no huddle on the quicks right here it's going the express way because you know there's no way you can stop me man one yard away i can do this coach come on one yard away one yard away yes good blocking good blocking guys oh shit did i make it did i make it yes first down here are the people who you supposed to be throwing the ball at me me and me Matrix mode. Oh, come on, O line. Come on. Ah. Uh, God damn it. Move your bum ass out of the way. Ooh, he's your first down right here, man. What the hell? Get the hell out of me, man. What the hell are you trying to do? Help me? Ooh, he's your run right here, man. Can't stop me. Can't catch me. Oh, shit, Matrix. Oh, get the fuck off me, boy. Oh, that was freaking nasty. Let's see that again, man. We gotta see that again. That was freaking nasty. You see that phone number on my hand? That's your girlfriend's number, and she wants me to take her virginity away. How's the weather down there? I just popped your cherry. How does it taste, motherfucker? Stiff arm, bitch! Oh, get on. Mmm, mmm, bitch! Your Facebook is gonna be filled with comments that say, What the fuck didn't you tackle him? True story, guys. After this, he lived in his mother's basement forever. Easy run to the left. God damn, that is here. Look at that. He didn't block. You lazy bum. Easy toss to the right, guys. What the hell, fullback? Fullback, you wanna get me killed? What the hell's the matter with you? Whatever, I'm just gonna run the clock down because, you know, my fullback is just trying to get me killed somehow. So, yeah, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this commentary. Hopefully you guys enjoy the gameplay and the intro stuff, you know, all the stories and stuff. Hopefully you guys liked it. You know, leave a like, leave a comment, tell me what you think. And uh, hopefully you guys come back for more, you know, because there will be like, a lot more episodes to come. And, uh, you know, hopefully you guys come for more and uh, hopefully you guys are falling in love with the series because, you know, I think it's going to be an awesome series, guys. So, yeah, you know, I won my first game. It was pretty awesome. But I only got like around 130 yards rushing. And uh, the reason why I couldn't get more is because I'm goddamn fullback. He wasn't blocking at all. And also the receivers. God damn it, man. Those, those guys don't block. Look at that. The freaking old line was just all messing up. The receivers don't even block for crap. I don't know guys, so uh, I don't know how much I have to struggle against these guys because you know I got tougher opponents later on in the schedule, especially Westlaco, you're going to be able to see why. And um, so yeah guys, you know, hopefully you guys come back for more, you know, leave a like and comment the video, tell me what's up. And uh, subscribe for more guys, subscribe for more and become an all-star. So yeah, if you guys need any tips or uh, any elite strategies for NCAA 13, make sure you visit allstars.com. So yeah guys, I'll see you guys later. and. Make sure you visit the next episode, guys. In episode 3, I'll be talking more about the um, Academy Memorial and uh, more stories, guys, to come. So, yeah, guys, I'll see you guys later. How does it taste, motherfucker?